Hey there, creators. So by now you know that if you are an influencer or creator and you are interested in partnering with brands to promote their products and services to your own following or as a UGC or CGC, which means user generated or content generated content creator and create uh, videos organic looking to native looking to social media platforms on their behalf as a service, then you know you're going to need a portfolio. Now, there are a lot of apps out there, desktop and smartphone apps that will actually host your portfolio for you, which is great. However, you control more if you host your own portfolio on a domain and a hosting that you own. And it's as cheap as $1.99 per month, which is less than the cost of a daily latte. You can have, for example, my name is JJ Gat. So you can have jjgat.com for $1.99 per month hosting. You can use that domain to actually host a link tree. So instead of using something like a link tree or using a social tab, you can actually have your own name. So mine is jjgat.com backslash links. Um, there's a lot of different things we won't get into now that you can also do when you host your own domain but for now I'm just going to show you how in under one hour you can actually today have your own domain with your own links page that's going to host your portfolio and it's going to look great it's going to look polished and at the other end I'm going to show you how to actually what the steps are all right let's see what you're going to do is you're going to go over to when you get to the your dream host account you're going to see your options to choose a hosting plan like I said for $1.99 a month you can actually host a website. So here's a monthly plans. So no joke, it's $1.99 per month. It's one website. Um, if you added a domain, an email, it's $7.99. So let's say my name is uh, JJ Gat and I want to add jjgat.com. In addition to $1.99 a month, I would be paying an additional $7.99 plus the $7.99. My bad. Right. So you get unlimited traffic, you get your bandwidth, you get the free SSL certificate. Why the SSL certificate is important. And when you get to you, when you purchase this, make sure you install it is that if without the SSL certificate, you're going to get this HTTP without the S with the S Google will now serve your content up your video your website up to anyone who comes to your website. They're going to see it without that SS HTTPS without that S when they go to your website, they're going to get a block. So let me, when you get this without the S without the security, you need to add that you can add an email, right? Which I think is important. So if you want to be a business, it's a great idea. If people see you seriously, if you, instead of having a, a JJ at Gmail account, I have a create at JJ Gat or hire at JJ .com, something like that. So that is actually a monthly fee in additional, but it's still $1 and 67 cents. When you total the cost of that, you spend more than that on a couple, a lot to each day. You get a report and you get website builder. Website builder is important. That's brand new because that allows you to one click install your domain. Super, super easy with no hassle. And you have automatic WordPress migrations. What this means is that you already have a site someplace else. Someone else already built your WordPress site. If you have a blog, you can actually migrate that over to this new host. All right. So those are the options you have. DreamPress is a little bit more complicated. Not for you. See 100K monthly visitors. If you're just starting out, you don't need this. Um, and then, and then also here with the VPS basic, the virtual private service, that's a little bit more like work, like more work for you. You just need a shared starter account for someone who's just starting out, which is $1 all nine, nine cents a month. Now there's going to be a benefit that you get for switching to the yearly plan. Let's see what happens. When you switch to yearly plan. When you switch to yearly plan, the price goes up to two dollars and ninety five cents, but you know what you get with that? You get a free domain is included. So you go ahead. And you should do that. I highly recommend that because the, the ultimate price. Let's say I were to sign up for this with that free domain. I'm paying today three dollars and fifty four thirty five dollars and forty cents for a website. For full year that includes my domain, I added GabrielGat.co. Um, I created this. I did a, this tutorial, GabrielGat.com tutorial, and I saved it on my Loom. The Loom didn't save it, so I'm doing it all over for you. So I hope you appreciate this. So, so I, I in order to just show you, I type GabrielGat.co, which is free. Um, I get domain privacy, which is free, and domain privacy means that people don't know who hosted. So after a year, these poachers, what they do is let's say a year passes and you're not checking your email or you're out of town or you're out of the country and they're sending you emails saying, hey, GabrielGat.co is about to expire. If you don't respond within a certain amount of time, these poachers will come and try to take your domain, especially if you've already made something of the domain and made it popular. So with domain privacy, 
instead of them doing that to you, dream host will give you some time and they will actually try to contact you in order to renew it. So that's why domain privacy. And also they'll be the listed as the owner of the domain versus you. When you sign up, you're going to put your email, your personal information that's available on the online publicly. <laughs> so if you hit domain privacy, people aren't going to know your name, your address of who hosts that domain. So you want to definitely do domain privacy, which is free with the shared hosting plan. So you do the yearly one for $2.95 for today. You're paying $35.40. You can choose a domain later or you can register a new domain or if you already have one you could navigate it this is what happens i'm going to walk you through what happens when you click this button so the next step is going to be what what's going to happen is you're going to it's going to automatically install it and with one click you get options so let's go if you have the option for pre-install wordpress select that why happens is going to connect your domain automatically to the wordpress and install wordpress for you that's amazing. Um, and then what happens is it set up the hosting for you and it finalizes setup and you don't have to worry about it. And instead of installing WordPress, it does it all together. And then you could just click this button right here to open up your WordPress editor and voila. So now um, once you install your thing, you want to have to actually have a nice, um, not that plain site. You want to have one that's kind of like custom already. Um, in WordPress themes, you can actually under themes, you have a whole collection of them. They're all free. So you don't even have to purchase one. Um, so I have installed, so you can pick one depending on your style and your taste. And I chose this Creo, um, and then you can customize it. So, um, you push customize and, um, okay. From here, you can change the design, the color palette, the background, the photos, the pictures. Well, here you have, you can change the design. If you click here, um, you can edit that page council, or you can click the name, click that. You can change the name here. You can change the font style of the name here, the size and everything. So you see, you hover over anything here, the contact button, you can add menu items. You can make custom icons. So instead of the um, these socials, you can use custom socialized custom icons if you can upload them there. Um, so wherever you see a um, wherever you see a uh, X, okay, wherever you see this button is where you can customize. Uh, you customize all of these things. So you want to change this the testimonial, change the name here, and change the font. It makes it super drag and drop easy to customize them by just clicking there, clicking that, click, clicking that. Um, yeah, so that's how you customize it. And then you hit publish when you're done. Hope that's helpful. I hope that was a helpful walkthrough. In that little segment there, you were able to set up your, um, get a uh, dream host, which I recommend I use. Um, I'm an affiliate them, full disclosure. And there'll be a link below where you can actually get started. And with one click, website install, go to the themes, select the theme that you like, and then simply customize it. And so it's just like, it's simple. It just makes so much sense and so much more dollar sense as well. And also if you do the option of getting your own email uh, that I mentioned, you'll definitely look like you are doing this for business. Now, if you were interested in an agency to represent you because you're looking for um, um, brands, uh, I want to invite you to join my agency. And if you are a brand and you're looking for content creators, I'd like you to also click the link below and you're looking for content creators to create organic native looking content that you can then use in your marketing, advertising, promotional processes and campaigns, then definitely hit me up. So yeah, so, and if you would like more information about this, I want you to check out this video right here.